What's up, YouTube? Welcome to the Aviators channel. So, I just did a video uh, a couple days ago on the RV and the new instruments, and I went and flew it. Sorry, I'm all dirty here. And uh, one of the other upgrades I did on this plane was a stiffener on the nose gear, um, for obvious reasons. I mean, this one had a nose gear collapse. And uh, when we did that, we epoxied the fairing on, uh, on the nose gear, and I'm gonna show you all this. Um, and when I flew it and landed, I got a little bit of a shimmy on, on landing, uh, and that fairing cracked. And we knew it would when we epoxied it on because it just had, you know, fiberglass has no give in it. And so it cracked. And so I thought I'd do a video on how to repair fairings. So here goes. I'll, I've done a lot of the work, but I'll kind of show you. Um, I'll insert a picture right here. Of where the uh, where the crack was and uh, what I've done to repair it so uh, here we are all right so here is the crack and what I've done is I've ground this down you can see it kind of crushed in here a little bit so I've taken it all the way back to good material this is two inches by six inches around and here is the fiberglass that I've already put in uh, plastic and I'll wrap some peel ply around that uh, all you need is, uh, I'm actually using three layers of fiberglass, and I kind of um, saved you the, the trouble of, of laying that up. It's pretty easy to do, and I didn't want to make this a 30-minute video. So, um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to lay that around um, this area. I've taken it down to clean fiberglass, and I'm going to wrap this new piece around this. Uh, right up and right up to these shoulders that I've ground into this okay and uh, and should be as good as new uh, I'll body work it uh, shoot this whole fairing here and uh, and be done and like I said when we when we did this we knew this was gonna crack it just it, it had to find its relief and now that it's done that I can repair it and make it as good as new you can see if you look in there the stiffeners in there this is the uh, the gear leg here that's spring steel under there um, and here we go all right so here we go what we're gonna do is uh, I should probably be wearing gloves when I do this but uh, I'm just gonna lay it up and so here is the uh, the fiberglass that I'm using and the first thing I'm gonna do is just paint a thin coat of resin and this is two-part epoxy resin over the area where I'm gonna lay this up. And that'll give it good adherence. going to do is peel the plastic off this glass that I cut. Now we're going to lay that up on there. Just like that. Okay. Now we'll take this other layer of plastic off. And look at that. Now, for the special part, the peel ply. Now what you want to do with peel ply is go ahead and lay it on here like so, okay. And what that's gonna do is that's gonna make it really easy to work this out. When I say work it out, I mean when this fiberglass, as we let it cure here, 
we want it to uh, we want it to be as flat as possible. And you can get all these. Uh, most paint stores will have some peel ply. Um, and then what we're going to do is just tap all of the bubbles out of this. And you want to work it in a way that you're. See how those bubbles get in there? You want to take those bubbles out. And you do that just by stroking it nice and softly. There. Now I'll get on the other side. Okay, and I made a little bit of a mess here on my fairing, so I'm gonna have to get some acetone and clean that out, but that is it. We'll let that cure, probably take three or four hours, and then we'll uh, take the peel ply off. Okay, so here's our repair after about six hours. I'm gonna go ahead and take this peel ply off. And that turned out really, really good. Really good, really happy with that. So now, uh, I won't bore you with uh, body work and paint, but uh, this thing will look good as new as soon as I sand it down, uh, top coat it, and then, uh, you know, uh, should be fixed permanently. Okay, so uh, that's how you repair a fairing. Um, tomorrow I'll you know, body fill it and sand it down and then uh, probably shoot some paint on it. I'm not going to video any of that. Painting is so messy, I just, I don't like to video it. But, uh, you know, if you guys want to uh, learn how to, you know, do paint body filler work, there's a ton of YouTube videos on it. But uh, anyways, so if you like this sort of thing, like, subscribe, comment. Till next time.